In this video, we're gonna teach you everything that you need to know about reviving a dead Instagram account or page. It's not as hard as you think, I've got ya. So make sure you stay all the way to the end so that way you can grab all the value I'm about to give you in this video. And for those of you who don't know me, my name is Jake by day I'm a digital marketing manager and by night I run an Instagram network of over 250,000. So if you get some good value from this video, make sure you smash that thumbs up button and consider subscribing to the channel. It really helps. Let's get into it. Now let's imagine that you have an Instagram account that you put a ton of time into a few months ago and you might have just got too busy or you got bored of the account in any capacity you want back in. So yeah, we've all been there. What we need to do is we actually just need to start posting on that account again. That's the first thing that you wanna get going. You need to post every single day, multiple times a day. In fact, two or three times a day is the best number to get going with. Thank you, sweet pea. And once you start posting on this dead account, it will in fact hemorrhage followers. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it for you. You're gonna start losing followers on this dead account once you start posting because people didn't realize they were still following this dead account. But while you're bleeding followers from this account, you're actually gonna see who's interested in your content still. So you're gonna see the people who like your content, which your likes obviously aren't gonna be what they were before. And you're gonna see the people that are really engaged with your content, AKA the people that comment on your content. So think of reviving your account as sort of a science experiment, right? What you wanna do is you wanna head over to all the people that comment on your posts and respond to their comments. And when I say respond to these comments, you need to respond to them in an insightful and thoughtful manner. You don't wanna just respond to somebody's comment on your post and say nice or thank you. Ask them a question. Ask them something that gets them to comment again and engage with your content. That tells the Instagram algorithm that it's a good piece of content. So when you're posting your content, make sure you give people a good call to action to actually turn on post notifications for your content. And the reason that you want people to turn on your post notifications is because you want them to keep coming back and engaging with your content. If those followers that you have that you retain after bleeding followers after posting for a little while stay and they're actually engaging with your content, that tells the Instagram algorithm that you're back and you're posting great content. Another really good and helpful thing for you to do is stick strictly to your niche, okay? Don't post any content that's even slightly outside of your niche. If your niche is cars, you're gonna post just cars. You're not gonna post something about cars. You're not gonna post any advertisements. Posting advertisements and promos is a no-go and that will actually drive your account from a dead account to a completely dead account nail straight in the coffin. And another good way to entice your followers to not only stay, but bring in new people to your account is to host giveaways or give them something of value for free. So let's say you run an account on Instagram marketing, give them a free ebook on how to do Instagram marketing. If you run an account on how to do your hair or your nails, give them something, give them a product from your company, give them something of value so that way they can spread the word and want to retain you and your account as a following. And another really good way to actually boost up those numbers again is while you're hemorrhaging followers or even after you're done hemorrhaging followers, go use follow for follow or the $1.80 comment strategy. You're not starting from nothing, but you are starting with a handicap. Be patient, use follow for follow, get that organic growth up again, and make sure that you don't stop using follow for follow or the $1.80 comment strategy, which I talk about in the video here, until you actually have that organic growth that surpasses the amount of people that are unfollowing your account on a daily basis. And to round everything up that we've talked about in this video, the most important thing is that you are consistent. Post stories, post polls in your stories, get the people that actually follow you to interact that tells the Instagram platform that, hey, this account is active, this account is popping. Post every day, don't stop, don't miss a day, post on a schedule and let people know that they can expect to hear from you at this time and this day and this often. And you know what, before you know it, you'll be growing organically again, you'll be popping off. You just need to follow the things that I talked about in this video. So if you have a specific question over one of the things that I covered in this video, please leave it in the comments section down below. Don't forget to smash that thumbs up button for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe to the channel. I'll catch you later. 